All right, YouTube, Paladin Vicos here, ready to run in here and take down Aldrich. Uh, I'm not sure if I was just tired last night or what the deal was, but I'm well rested and ready to take him on. He's holding down circle, don't know why he's running or jumping. Right. What? <laughs> I don't even know what attack she did. He did. It, devourer of gods. Alright, so let's try this again. Since my shield doesn't really work all that well anyway. your shit woman Don't get greedy. Die, you bitch. Well, that didn't seem so bad. I don't know what the deal is, man. Like, 
Maybe I was just tired from playing so late. I don't know. Definitely a lot easier than my previous video showed. So, With that said, I apologize for how long it took me in the last one. Um, I am going to severely edit that. I uh, will still show every death. Uh, all hundred of them, it seemed. But, anyway, we now have Aldrich's soul, so let's head back to the shrine. That was definitely a lot easier <laughs> than the time I had last night. Last night was, well, like I said, it was embarrassing. Is she back yet? And I really hope Patches didn't do anything with her. That's Yorm's seat. Is this older? Yes. Is that, is that the tail? Oh, her skull. Half a skull. Let's see what the pygmy will give us. Yes. Life Hunt Scythe. That's interesting. And the Dark Moon Longbow. 7, 16, and 10. Hmm. Longbow of Dark Moon Gwendolyn, who is gradually devour, devoured by Aldrich. This golden bow is imbued with powerful magic and is most impressive with moonlight arrows. Dark moon arrow infuses a readied arrow with dark moon essence, granting it magic damage and the ability to pierce shields. say about us killing two Lords of Cinder or he's still not back Oh, I do have another ash to give our vendor. Speak thy desire, honorable lord of hollows. Our lord, and knowest thou of a machine of Yeah, you don't have anything new to say. Ah, tis good, wasn't he? Oh, yes, I have. Be cool for you. <clears throat> Look at that peaceable giant. Seems like ages past. I imagine his passing was long ago. I miss the old bugger I do. My thanks. I'll be sure this coal is put to good use. I'll be smithing weapons never before seen by the likes of ye. It's but a small service to pay my now we should be able to get our lightning claymore. Infuse claymore. Oh man, why does it drop so low? Oh, I guess it's 
lightning and physical. Chaos Claymore, that's pretty cool. That does have a scaling of faith. Well, that's what we want. Now I need two Titanite chunks to level that up again. The shards. I don't, I don't think anybody's in the same. No. You, I need to give you. Well, I do, but you aren't going to take it. You. Uh -huh. Passing five let this ash. I only hope these <laughs> Hmm. Smooth set. Grotesque armor associated with Smo, the last knight to stand in defense of the ruined cathedral. Boasts extreme high defense and can be donned by humans, but not without great difficulty. That is crazy. Okay, so Walnir's crown. Honest Slayer, Great Arrow. Huh. Hmm. That's cool. Slows weapon degradation, although I haven't had an issue with that. These are some pretty badass armors I need to buy eventually. Gives you fifteen thousand. Welcome home, my speaker. Very well. Then touch the cake now. Uh, actually, let me back out and see how much I need for lightning spear. Great heal needs twenty five. Lightning Spear. Okay, I have enough for Lightning Spear, so I just need 25 and I can use everything that I have. And my weapon now scales with Welcome faith, home, so... Okay, looks like we can get to 24. So, 337. Oh, 
yeah, we definitely get our biggest damage increase from faith. But I also need attunement. Yep, I believe that's what we want. just healed my dark sigil 90,000 well if I would have sold no even if I sold Aldrich's soul I still would have only been at 85 I need arrows actually I would like resins instead. Well, I don't need resins because I just infused my weapon, never mind. Alright, let's continue on. a lift. That's a lift as well. So this would have been the room you fought Hornstein and Smo. There's Quinn. Guinevere. or not missing, rather banished firstborn. That was kind of pointless. Raise the chest. The Sun Princess Ring. Gradually restores HP. Ring associated with Guinevere. Princess of Sunlight and the eldest daughter of Gwyn, the First Lord. The ring is vaguely warm like a beam of sunlight and gradually restores HP. Guinevere left her home with a great many other deities and became a wife and mother, raising several heavenly children. <clears throat> I 
okay, in the first Dark Souls, she was here, but it wasn't really her. I mean, she was ginormous. I mean, she's a god, basically. But um, what it was is she was casting an illusion across all of on Orlando, making it bright and sunny, when actually the whole place was enshrouded in darkness. This kind of begs, is any of this an illusion? does not appear to be. That's kind of pointless. So it does not appear that there is anything left in this room. Yeah, that's her. She would have been up there laying across that bed. All right, anyway. I guess we will travel to the dungeon. Well, guys, I think I am going to end this episode here. We will pick up in the next one. Sorry, this one's so short, but I kind of want to devote a whole new video to exploring this area. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you tuning in, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye!